what was often happening is when we when we receive referrals, um, a lot of the refer people who were referring to the service were saying, I don't know where to refer into, so I always refer into mental health services. That's because uh, in the in the community we're not always aware of what's available, um, and so it, that was where we thought actually we needed a more of a navigation tool and an information tool to be able to help people who were referring to the service know where to refer to, rather than um, us rejecting referrals or they're coming to us they wait for a little while are seen by us and we're saying actually you didn't need to wait to see us there were other, other services around that could have helped you and supported you in the meantime. So it is a for the use User, what they see is a website, um, although it's actually an app that looks like a website. And the idea is that um, it presents with a number of statements about various aspects of a young person's life and then you do a rating. Now for most tools that you would use, the rating would be something like mild, moderate, severe. And people don't know how to rate those because actually that's very personal, what you would count as a severe problem, for instance. So we put some descriptions in to help people to think, okay, well, that, that fits more with something that's more of a difficulty than this, which is kind of quite mild. So the people, there are different elements, different users that can access the Dimensions um, tool, which we badgers or talk about as being an information and navigation tool. So from if you're a member of the public, Anybody can go onto the website, you don't need to have a login, you can just go in there and use and start to rate and you can do it as a parent, as a carer on the child, you can do it as somebody who, um, for themselves, if they look at the adult version. And the idea would be they go through the dimensions and they rate the child in particular who they're, they're, they're thinking about and at the end they will get a report. The report um, provides for um, visual well, diagrams to help understand where the child's area of strength and needs are. Um, within the report as well it also provides some self-care flyers. These self-care flyers have been created um, by clinicians within the service um, and so instead of going to Google and saying I think I have problems with anxiety and you get lots of information actually what we've tried to do is find trust, more trusted information um, around something like anxiety and also some local resources that might be available. We've also looked at things like uh, apps that are available and websites as well as other resources such as books that might be helpful for that person.